What is happening guys? Cowboy here and welcome to Omen Sight. Now this is a new indie game that came out a little bit ago that kind of flew in under the radar for me. But Discord actually brought it to my attention and asked if I'd like to check it out and do some videos on it. So on that note, this video and the next couple videos are actually sponsored by Discord. So I'm going to have a link directly to this game right down in the description, as well as a link to my Discord, which if you're not a part of yet, you definitely have to get in there and join the rest of the Booty Nation. But either way, let's jump in and get into this game. Uh, I've been looking through some reviews of it and some videos. It's like an action, adventure, murder, mystery type thing. And it actually looks pretty fucking awesome. Which, uh, you know, usually in sponsor games, it's like, hey, play this weird mobile game we've never heard of. So this should be a blast, in my opinion. Euralia, a prosperous land, home to many tribes. The gods entrusted the bird tribes to watch over the others. The tribe founded Pegaria, and all lived in harmony under the banner of the Pegarian Empire. Until seven years ago, when Pegaria began recruiting the dog and cat tribes. As their strength grew, the other tribes suffered. To protect themselves from Pegarian oppression, the scattered rodent and bear tribes formed an alliance, led by a rebel named Ratika. Tonight, the Pegarian Empire launches a brutal assault on the Rodentian capital under orders of Emperor Rindrick. When the capital falls, his conquest of Euralia will be complete. And far from the front lines, one who could have brought peace, the godless priestess Vera, has been murdered. In her absence, there is no one left to protect Euralia and its people. The end times are near. Euralia needs a savior. So it's the bird people, dog people, and cat people versus the bears and the mice. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, I'm pretty sure a bear would absolutely destroy bird cat and dog people but you know we'll see maybe maybe the uh, cat people are fast with rapiers or something you know, I've seen puss in boots I know how how spicy he can be what the the emperor warned us about redemption sorcery kill the intruder quick but sir that glow that sword. Is it the Harbinger? What? You think it's the end of the world? Do you see any floods? Any earthquakes? No, sir. But the elders, they say the Harbinger comes to prevent the end of the world, not cause it. Could be the Harbinger or a redemption sorcerer. I'm not taking any chances. Mm, okay. Let's do this. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Alright, um, this is gonna be fun. I didn't know we got anime dodges up in this. Sit down. Little did they know, I'm a master of super speedy dodge. Ooh. Can I, can I go into things? Right, I'm just gonna just mess around a little bit here. Oh, that's cool. I like how I have different tiers. Like I have like roll, roll, vault, and a flip. Let's see what about my combos? So attack, attack, thrust. Let me see if there's timed combos too. All right, so if I keep if I keep moving the left stick, I can just infinite attack without having to go into the thrust combo or like AOE clear. I got double jump. 
is why I got anything. Figures and bumpers don't do anything. All right. All right, I think I got this. All right, and I guess we're not going back. Your best fighter is dead. Catch. Ludimir? It's Bear Dude. You killed Ludimir? Your friend thought he could storm in and kill Emperor Injigal by himself. I can tell you this. He met the Emperor all right. And when he did, well, your friend's death was slow and painful. You're sick, just like your master. And where's your Emperor now, anyway, huh? Too sacred to show up for battle? Oh, don't you worry. Indrik is coming. And he's more powerful now than you can ever imagine. But you will not get to bask in his light. For What is that thing, sir? The redemption to toying with dark magic. Attack! Flash you tackle! Yeah, come and get it. Come and get it. You got no chance. I'm too fast over your head. Coming in from behind. Get stabbed. Better pray I never get special abilities because my attack chains are way out there. Ow. I am not an action gamer. Give me that hard. Let's go. Increase the difficulty. I'm sure there's some guy. If there's like an, uh, there's gotta be like an upgrade system where it's like you know hold X to do like a charged AOE. Oh man. Bear man. Oh wow, I can do like spirit manipulation. I will make things right, sister. Indrek, I will smash your precious temple to bits if you don't come out. Ludomir was a great warrior, loyal to the Redemption clans. You can feel the hatred he had for Emperor Endric was unmatched. Investigate around first. Is all just empty? Okay. You are the Harbinger. So we are all in danger. The threat. Do you know what it is? Did you investigate the godless priestess? That look in your eyes. You have never heard of the priestess. Hmm. To begin, ever since the first godless priestess appeared, the world has been a safer place. As if she scares the darkness away. But now the priestess is dead. Murdered? I am certain this is what has brought you here. Her murder is a sign of great danger. I only wish I had more time. Do I just take people's souls? Or or free them or uh, I should have seen it. <laughs> Sooner. A bond with Dragus souls created by fate. Drag was one of the Emperor Endric's generals. You can feel the mutual trust between Emperor Endric and her. You there! What are you? Wait. Did you kill General Draga? Murderer! I'll have your head for this! Man, it's always the basic bitches jumping to conclusions. No, get out of here, shield man. Boop. Get out of here. Oh. 
Look at that. I, I was doing so damn good in combat, I pushed the game into a cutscene. Torn by war has come to an end. After 300 years, the great serpent Bodin has returned to devour the world. The Harbinger, awakened to fight this threat, learned of the godless priestess, of her role in protecting Euralia, and of her murder. But this was no simple murder. The immortal soul of the priestess always returns to the world. Always. But not this time. Rodin's return was planned. The world has ended. But there is yet a flicker of hope. Harbinger! Focus on my voice. Let me help. Game stories, Paths of Destinies takes place in the same universe as Omen Sight. I remember we like tried to play that game. We like played it with the beta, and then I never followed up on it when it came out. Huh. Harbinger. So I can summon you here. Thank the gods. Do you know who I am? You did not inherit your predecessor's memories. We have no time to worry about that. Know that you are the Harbinger. You are the eyes of Euralia. You are its sword. And you are the only hope we have left. When Vodin is done devouring the world, he will find this place. No, he is already searching for it. And when he finds it, well... Fighting Bodin is now impossible. Too strong. Even if you are victorious, there is not much of a world left to save. Harbinger, I brought you here for a reason. There is a way to save Euralia, but it will not be easy. I cannot force you to accept. But if you are willing, then come to me. Gain enough XP to level up, meditate before the chalice to gain new powers. Amber to receive a blessing, offer tribute before the anvil in exchange for various benefits. Meditate, gift Amber. Alright, let me go do that first. Are these statues representing... Okay, I thought maybe they were like... Statue characters of like the souls I was getting. Phantom Blast. Loss of projectile that damages and knocks down enemies. You can gain energy by chaining attacks and dodges. You lose energy if you break the flow. This happens if you are hit or if you do nothing. Fires a blip. Hold and release X. Oh, and you, you gotta manually target it. This is cool. Okay. What about gifting Amber? Um, I have 1,500. Wait. I, okay, I back down. Um, maximum health, increase the amount of damage dealt on a heavy attack, grants perfect dodge. Dodging at the last minute will slow time down. That sounds really freaking good. Like, maybe I should save up my XP and get that good, but I'll get the heavy attack because let's go. But Harbinger is Aegis. I mean, uh, considering my experience with dodge timings, all about it. Anyway, let's see what the witch has. Oh, thank you, Harbinger. The Tree of Life. There is ancient power here. One that transcends the bonds of space and time. That power can send you into the past. You will have a chance to investigate the death of the godless priestess. If you find her soul, then the Tree of Life can spin it back to Euralia. And that may be enough to prevent Vodin from appearing in the first place. And we have a suspect. Emperor Indric. You saw his war. There is no end to his ambition and cruelty. He may even be mad enough to unleash Vodin. 
And that means murdering the godless priestess and hiding her soul. The souls you bonded with. The tree can latch on to them, send you to the dawn of their last day. There is Ludomir. Oh, they he are. died at the hands of the Emperor. If you meet Ludomir before his death, if you follow him, you will find Indrik. Then there is Draga, who seems to understand the stakes. She may help your investigation in a way no one else can. Investigate the Emperor and the death of the godless priestess. Find her soul. But which lead will you follow? Draga or Ludomir? Make your choice. All right, well... <clears throat> Honestly, like as much as I get it, Emperor is the bad guy. I don't feel the Emperor would release the thing. He's trying to conquer the world, not burn it down. I feel like this one, she recognized me and was like, "Oh man, that means it's come to pass." I feel like that's going to be a better lead. So it begins. Another chance to save Euralia. I'm going back in time. And... Hmm. You should delay a fate to set up combos with other powers, such as Phantom Grasp, to grab or throw a bomb. General! Give me two battalions, and I shall capture the core for you! I do not doubt it. But those battalions would turn the battlefield into a graveyard. For them, and the Rodentians both. Iron Trek's fury is the key for a swift victory. My lady is wise. But what if the fury fails us during the assault? Then we walk. Now, let us review the battle plan once more. Our main army will initiate a frontal assault. We will simultaneously hit the northern and eastern gates. When we do, Emperor Indrik will bring the fury through the rear. Assuming we can trust the source. The Emperor secured the information personally. We will follow the Rodentians' secret path through the Dead Forest into the heart of their city. We will seize the core and end their resistance. I was hoping the guards would leave, but I guess I'll just, uh... Intruder! I will protect you with my life, General. Stand down, Captain. If murder was her intent, she would have already struck. No. I've read of this figure. The Harbinger. Harbinger. Why do you grace us with your presence? Something must have happened. And you think I can help you? It can't be the war. Must be something spiritual. The murder of the godless priestess. General Dragon! The prison! Riots! Now? Ah. Oh. Radica, is that your move? Of course it is. I expect no less from the Rodentian leader. You must have a plan to stop us, and I cannot allow that. And you, Harbinger. A favor given is a favor repaid. Help me with this, and I shall aid you in any way I can. Rodentians! Surrender, and you will be spared! Freedom or death! Just a bomb? Really? Boom, boom, boom. Everywhere. Did you bring reinforcements? I brought something much better. It's the harbinger. Let's go. that up. I want that perfect dodge thing. This 
right trigger companion ability. Powerful spell that burns all enemies in a large area. Looks like she'll do it wherever I'm at. Run, brother, run. Boom! Like that. Someone Oh, <laughs> let's go! Boom! A Fatumu Blaster! Oh shit! Okay, the mouse man. I'm gonna need you to calm down. No! Nope. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! <laughs> with the perfect dodge, coming in at the last second. Ooh! Ooh! Good thing we are fighting side by side. Yeah, it got a little, uh, a little close there on the health. Um, what is this? So do I like, come back and oh? So I wonder if there's like replay mechanics and you need keys to unlock different parts in time, maybe. And it looks like I do not heal up or anything. Oh, there we go. All right, so you can find items to heal up, and I bet there's some goodies behind this. What are we waiting for? Um, I'm sorry, Miss Plot Armor, who doesn't have to worry about her health. Maybe you can hold on for like five seconds while I try to heal? Yeah, thanks. Helping hand. Alright, so she'll just boost me. Wait, was that? Can I do that with a heavy? Okay, no, there's no change. There's something wrong with your sword. Lady, calm down. See, this is if you just if I just ran over to her, I wouldn't have 2300 experience upgrade stuff right now. Uh oh. Oh no, what did I do here? Oh no. No, wait. No wait. Is this This is a hidden area, I think. No. What is going on? Did I... Okay, never mind. I think I found a bug. <laughs> I think I found a bug. Um, reload checkpoint. At first, I thought it was one of those, like, hidden zones. How, like, you know, in, in some some games like this, you, like, go behind the scene, basically. Um, but no, that was definitely not the case there. Whenever you are ready, Harbinger. Tell you what, though. That was, an, that was a real easy fix, uh, which is good to see. Nothing is worse than not... Like, like, having a bug always sucks, but I think a bigger problem is when you can't recover from that bug. Bug recovery is paramount, and that was so a uh, very effortless recovery. Is it really the death of the priestess that has brought you to me? I will do my best to help you. Vera was... She was deeply respected. I would hate to stand by and see the murderer go unpunished. They must be waiting for us to charge headlong. Let us first level the playing field. Oh man. I surrender. Can't fathom a reason why the Harbinger would do that. Well, it might have to do with the fact that I just pressed the attack button before I heard that he was gonna surrender. 
and um, you know, whoopsie daisies. Sometimes things like that happen, and uh, I really hope that doesn't like come back to bite me in the ass, like. Oh, as the ruthless harbinger, you were unable to save the world, murdering innocents before you. And now the prisoners are writing insults in ancient Hungarian. Who taught them? Ah, such filthy language, and the spelling is all wrong. I wonder if later, because I feel like <clears throat> I feel like you could move that. This wall just screams of like I'm gonna break. And I feel like you could break that and then get to that chest. But I need a way to be able to move barrels, and I'm guessing that's something I probably unlock later on. Your uprising almost impressed me. Almost. Now, lower your weapons. Ratika is not worth dying for. I am mighty General Draga. Tell me, General, how do you sleep at night knowing everything your Emperor has done? Or do you enjoy the killing and the torture? I am loyal to Emperor Indrik. Surrender and give me Ratika. Now. Not a chance. I think he's gonna do something. Follow me. I have a plan. You want me to cut his throat from behind, right? I got they you. They do not know about this path. Kill them all. And with the fire. Boom! Let's go! Flawless victory! Soldiers, secure the area! Yes, General. Right, there's gotta be a switch somewhere to open that up. Not just there yet. Oh. Some soldiers say that she was sniffing around Yarbold's temple not long before her death. The rumor goes as far as claiming that she has been caught inside the Emperor's ancestral crypt. Ah, nonsense. The crypt is protected by an unbreachable seal. This looks like something that's glowy, some kind of relic upgrade I can get. Oh yes, oh yeah, give me all of the stuff. Oh god, yeah, two chests. We need to go. Nah, you need to hang on, lady. New memory obtained. Gusto, Draga feigns interest as her father, Magu, describes in painstaking details passion for factory life. But Draga's mind cannot focus. Passing Imperial Guard catches her attention as she imagines the action they face fighting and protecting. Imagine Draga. Tomorrow you'll be promoted from grain silos to first floor conveyor belts. So her father wanted her to just work in a factory and she wanted to go military. Oh, look at 
this cool ass magic. I've been thinking. Vera was a fierce advocate for peace with Rodentia, even met with Ratica and her people. Caused quite a diplomatic stir. Perhaps Radica can tell you more, if she's in an honest mood. Boss fight? Where did you go, little mouse? I was hoping to end the war with minimal bloodshed. No doubt Radica has slipped away to the forest and joined the enemy forces. Come. It seems we will face her on the battlefield. No boss fight. Alright, well, considering we've made it through the whole Imperial prison, and we're going back to the forest, I think this is a, as good a spot as any to wrap on up. Uh, so the game plan for this series is to just kind of work it in between the current Metro episodes, so you'll be getting this middle of the afternoon, Monday through Friday, all the way up until the end. So once again, thanks to the Discord for sponsoring this series. Make sure to check the game down in the description below, and also join my Discord if you haven't already. I mean, I don't know why you wouldn't. It's like the coolest Discord out there, obviously. Uh, but either way, make sure to stay tuned, and we'll catch you guys tomorrow with more Omen Sight.